Really in the early stages, a lot of what we're seeing is limited operational domains. By that I mean the AVs don't operate under all conditions or on every roadway. One of the things we're looking at is being able to get a certain sense of awareness that's not just from the autonomous vehicle. We can use sensory uh, perception from other cars, for example, or from the infrastructure. That, that uh, additional information would allow for a safer and more efficient uh, operation in that more complex domain. The connection of that data from the remote sensing source to the vehicle itself must be wireless. The network service providers could actually incorporate a terrestrial um, location system that doesn't depend on uh, viewing the sky and the GPS satellites or GNSS satellites. That could enhance the positioning to enable the remote sensing to be of a good enough quality enable that remote sensing to it be incorporated in the vehicle system. I think they can really make um, significant contributions to the automated vehicle's awareness through an edge computing and communications architecture. One of the areas that's really quite ripe for innovation in this area that can lead to these new use cases like highly automated connected vehicles is really the compute and data storage space. The compute that's required in the vehicle is tremendous. You can incorporate technology developments that will really enhance the operational capability necessary to provide services for some of these markets where low latency, high availability, high reliability, Highly secure networks can really contribute to solving some of these use case challenges. I can envision or I can see a future like an automated trip where a vehicle that's not piloted by a human can pick me up at work and drive me all the way home even when it's raining or snowing. I think partnerships with people like Dell, who understand uh, computation and understand servers and data centers, with companies like Denso, who understand the, the workings, the inner workings of the vehicle systems and the edge and the compute and communications capabilities that those can afford. The combination of those two is almost uh, unlimited in, in the capability or in the markets that can be addressed.